You can take your hands out of, from in front of your eyes, Saul. Okay. Oh, King of Texas. Yes. Is there any sound? Mm -mm. <laughs> okay, so, um, Saul, I know you. You're a huge fan of anime, right? And mangas? Uh-huh. Yeah, you love that stuff, right? <laughs> so, earlier today, before you came over, I scoured the Steam Marketplace for the cheapest, po most poorly rated anime games I could find. <laughs> and I found this one, and I bought it for, like, two bucks. Nice. And it took a minute to install. <laughs> this is... King of Texas! <laughs> <laughs> I like the... That's a Texan accent. I like the menu. Yeah. Uh, where's the mouse? Where's the options? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's weird. Oh. You just do the keyboard, whatever that means. Unless it only uses the mouse then you'll have to use the mouse if it's the type of game i think which is like a kind of like just story click on the i wouldn't i wouldn't know i've never played one <laughs> so these are called otome games which is basically like a visual novel kind of like those walking dead games where you just mm -hmm. like, choose the options the telltale video games yeah but like not as well made you ready to start sure on this adventure are you familiar with the um the doki doki Literature? Yeah. And, the, like, the twist? Uh, he, I haven't played it, but I know, like, what happens. Okay, good. <laughs> this is nothing like that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thursday 12th, July 2018. Oh my god, what is... Is that today? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's pretty loud. <laughs> <laughs> you can turn it down with that. Oh. Oh yeah, look at that. It is very loud. It's in the yellows. Oh. oh. Georgia Wallace's office. Tex Oil Stadium. Dallas, Tex. Okay. I think we know where we are. Ooh. Oh my. What a nice painting. <laughs> <laughs> and now you have free reign here. You can do what you like. Sure. Should I talk in a Texan accent that I. Yes, please. Does she talk or. Um, do you have to oh, read it? Okay, so this is Georgia. Yeah. I like her hair. Yeah. Like her hat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what else? <laughs> She has really big pants. That's true. Look at how they like curve into her crotch. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a void. Mr. Baker, thank you for coming. Uh, in. Oh, Texas. <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit. Mr. Baker, thank you for coming in on this beautiful morning. Thank you. The pleasure is all mine, ma'am, and thanks again for drafting me into the Dallas Sheriff's. Oh, so I'm a cop. Sure. <laughs> oh. Rest assured that you can expect nothing but my 110% performance for every game. Oh, this is me. Oh. <laughs> I thought that's what we were doing. I'm very glad to hear that, Mr. Baker. When you, when we saw you play the NCAA finals against Arizona State, we knew that you had to pick. We, you had to pick you for the first draft. So I haven't told you what this game is about. It's about a football player from Louisiana joining a Texas team. Oh. And it's also in the <laughs> so, style of a so visual novel. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Cool. Were you there, ma'am? Of course I was. I would be remiss in my duties as the president of the Dallas Sheriffs if I missed a NCAA final. She owns the Dallas Sheriffs. Nice. How old is she? Like 10? <laughs> <laughs> Not with those. <laughs> what, those eyes? Yeah. 
Having a solid draft pick every year is key to the survival of our team. If you don't mind me asking, what team do you want to play for? Oh, think... uh, your team. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is where you finally get an option. Oh. oh. The New England Patriots. <laughs> so there's two real teams, and then this one. <laughs> Are you going to mm. kiss ass or are you going <laughs> to... I know. This, this is like the kiss ass button. I like how it wiggles. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> like a... <laughs> it's very phallic in shape, too. Oh, yeah. Ugh. It morphs. <laughs> Gross. Um... Hmm. <laughs> That's you. I'm not going to lie. I was hoping to go to the New England Patriots. That's no surprise. <laughs> so I win anyways. <laughs> I appreciate your honesty. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! <coughs> <laughs> yep, they sure are the best team out there right now, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> they won the last two Super Bowls, I'd say so. Not better than the Steelers, though. They sure are. But I hope we can work together to whoop them real good this year, right? Certainly, ma'am. Did you notice the cowboy boots at the bottom of yeah, the screen? I, I was gonna say, those are a very, it's a very nice touch. I may have been hoping to go to the Patriots, but now that I'm here, I assure you that you may have my absolute loyalty and dedication. Yeehaw. <laughs> I will give my 110% and work tirelessly to make sure that I bring the Super Bowl back to Tex Oil Stadium this year. Bald words. <laughs> she doesn't believe you. She's like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're full of shit. <laughs> I hope you're able to fulfill them. And me. <laughs> I, I have a question for you. Ask away, ma'am. I see that your last name is Bigger, and you hail from Louisiana. Would you be by any chance related to Billy Bigger? As a matter of fact, I am. Billy's my dad's younger brother. Yeah. <laughs> and, and my uncle. <laughs> oh, so he's your uncle. Oh. I was going he's like, you dipshit. <laughs> Just like, no shit, it's your uncle. That's right, ma'am. What? Are you a big fan of his... Oh, so Your uncle like a... is... So he's like a musician? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Yes, I am. He was the hottest thing when I was in college. Oh, what? Ooh, <laughs> you look like you're so 16. much Botox. <laughs> she has Joan Rivers beat by a mile. <laughs> R.A.P. Because she's still alive? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Georgia? Oh, sorry. <laughs> you know, he performed here at Texas, Texas Oil Stadium eight years ago when the Super Bowl final was held here. I didn't. I did know that. I remember attending that Super Bowl final. Uncle Billy bought us all tickets. Wow, that's mighty generous of him. <laughs> well, he still had that kiss in your heart money. Ah, I love that song. Is there oh. anything playing in the background of this? Yeah, it's like a little <laughs> like just country tune. <laughs> oh, nice. Get you immersed. <laughs> <laughs> but Uncle Billy was always been real generous. He helped me cover my costs while I was in college. Wait, you played in the NCAA. Weren't you on a scholarship? No, I sucked. Oh. I was, but the <laughs> NCAA didn't cover living expenses, so that's what my Uncle Billy provided. <laughs> yeah, it's tough playing in the NCAA and still trying to keep your grades at a certain level. And also... <laughs> 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 having to take a part-time job pay for those expenses. You wouldn't know anything about that, though, because your <laughs> uncle paid for it all. <laughs> I mean, I know it's against NCAA rules for a student to take part-time jobs, but I ain't no fool. I know that a lot of kids did secretly to help to cover the costs. I love this writing. It's so natural. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which is why my Uncle Billy insisted that I didn't take a part-time job so I could focus on studying and playing. Your Uncle Billy is a wise man. I like to fuck him. <laughs> he's single? Is he alive? Or they say he's dead? He certainly is. What's he up to now? Dead. He's no longer in the music industry. Oh no. That's a pity. What happened? Well, between his last album failing oh. the chart and his longtime manager moving to Japan <laughs> to get married, he kind of saw it as a sign that it was time to retire. 
dumbass. Yeah, what? Why would he move to Japan when all the hot anime girls are in Texas? <laughs> <laughs> he moved to the U.S. Virgin Islands and set up a TK what? bar. In <laughs> what? <cinnamon> <laughs> I heard he's doing real da well down there. Yeah? Mm-hmm. That's f fantastic. He's like, eh, never mind. I don't <laughs> want him anymore. <laughs> oh. I might go and pay that tiki bar a visit, if you know what I mean. You should. Oh, he's a cock. <laughs> <laughs> this is those type of games. <laughs> Cuck simulator. <laughs> Have you seen those? It's real. It's like there's like these VR games <laughs> where it's like you climb a tree. <laughs> oh you, god! And you see like your wife. Oh like, nice. With another like VR. Like a big black dude. <laughs> we. I need um, to get a VR just for that. <laughs> so you. <laughs> you good? Yeah. So you really were a big fan of my Uncle Billy's music, huh? <laughs> you bet I was. Actually, I was at the Super Bowl. I was at that Super Bowl final too, and I really enjoyed the performance. Okay. <laughs> Didn't you just say that? Yeah, they mentioned that. <laughs> wow, you were president eight years ago? How old are you? <laughs> <laughs> She's immortal. <laughs> She's like at least 30. Of course not. Eight years ago, I was fresh out of college and was working to, as the assistant manager, as the general manager here. Hmm. So, eight years ago, she was in call. She got out of college. So She's like, like 30 20, something. 22, 24. Fuck it. Who cares? Eight years later. <laughs> We're putting too much effort into this. Back then, it was my pal who was president. Oh. Georgia grabs a photo frame on her desk and shows it to you. You see a photo of an old man wearing a 10-gallon hat, tan suit, and a bolo tie. Oh, a bolo tie. <laughs> a 10-gallon hat. He looks a lot <laughs> like Colonel Sanders. <laughs> Kuriner san. How long was your pops president before you? Colonel Sanders doesn't wear a 10-gallon hat. My pops was been president and owner for over 30 years before he handed it to me at the post. Wait, what? Before he handed me the post two and a half years ago. Why'd he retire? He died. <laughs> he was getting old. His doctor didn't want him anymore. Bad for a strange. <laughs> she had a stroke. Go on. Doc also insisted that Pa retire from being chairman of Tex Oil Industries. You okay, Georgia? <laughs> <laughs> Need some water? I was president eight years ago. <laughs> How old is your Pa? 854. Holy sh. Yeah, I'm from his third marriage, which is why I'm so much old. Wait, which is why he's so much older than me. Mm hmm Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to pry, ma'am. I was just surprised. Oh, it's okay. Most of the employees here at the Texas Oil Stadium were hired by my pa, so you should know a thing or two about him. When do I get to fuck? Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, this is 13 minutes so far, and we're still in her fucking office. Of course. You hear a soft but determined knock on the door. How? How, <laughs> How do you tell the difference? <laughs> <laughs> well, listen. Ow, fuck, it <laughs> Oh, God, my knuckles. I forgot the soft. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. I was going for more determined. <laughs> yes? No, it's yee. Yee. <laughs> the door opens a little, and you hear a young woman's voice. Ooh. Georgia, is this a bad time? Come on in, Ashley. You know my door's always open. Oh, you're gonna have a three-way. Oh, my. Oh, oh. what? Who's she? <laughs> <They're>, <laughs> the blonde's name is Ash, and the other girl's name is Lee. <laughs> <laughs> They're twins. They couldn't afford. Yeah, they got some twins, all right. Yeah. Hey-o. <laughs> John, follow, allow me to make introductions. What is the middle one wearing? Like a corset dress? Looks like a... Oh, she's Bostonian. I love that accent. <laughs> Look how tiny her arm is. I know. Yeah. <laughs> the blo beautiful blonde Bostonian with the fabulous purple dress is Ashley Cunningham. She's the head of PR for the Dallas Sheriff's. Hey, how are you doing? Pleasure to meet you, Miss Cunningham. <laughs> this is like a weird dream. <laughs> like a fever, a fever dream. dream. <laughs> And the bombastic brunette with the killer bod is Molly Steele, our head cheerleader. She has tiny arms. Don't look at them. Put your <laughs> straps like great, you whore. <laughs> yeah, Jesus. 
Howdy. <laughs> She's a smoker. <laughs> I'll do that now. So you're Molly and John, and I'm the others. I love Molly. Pleasure to meet you too, Miss Steele. <laughs> Miss Steele. Ladies, this is John Bega. I'm a Bega for his cock. <laughs> <laughs> Our new running back. Good morning, ladies. Molly gives you a warm smile. A very warm smile. Which one's Molly? The middle one? The, the hat one. Oh. Ashley gives you a passing glance and immediately jumps into what she wanted to Ooh, talk about. She's gonna be the hardest. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna have to give her some Spanish fly. <laughs> Is that me? Yeah. Georgia, we need to we need a decision on something. What is it? As you know, the new NFL season is starting again in a couple of months, and when and that's when we sell the most subscriptions to our Dallas Sheriff Star magazine. Go on. <laughs> well, I feel we need to do more photo shoot. We need to do one more photo shoot with the cheerleaders to really have a variety and quality of photos needed for the promos of the magazine. That sounds like a mighty good plan. Yeehaw! What's the problem? Molly and I are debating as to where the, to do the photo shoot. <laughs> where did you want to do it, Ashley? I thought it would be wicked awesome if we did a photo shoot down at Key, Key West. You know, show the girls having a wicked beach pissa. What? A what? That is not an Americanism. <laughs> pissa? Pissa? Is that like a party? I guess so. I've never heard of that before. Our swimsuit edition always sells the best, and it's always great to have more photos of the girls in their bikinis. Why is she looking at you directly? I know. Good thinking. What about you, Molly? <clears throat> so, like a smoker cheerleader. <laughs> I think it would. <laughs> like that um, lady In from Family Guy. I was thinking, <laughs> you like Pez? No, I was thinking, um, oh shit! Oh, who oh cares? no! I, I skipped important dialogue. <laughs> I was thinking, um, that that secretary lady from Monsters Inc. Oh, Ross. Always watching you. Miss yeah, Alice. do that one. <laughs> Let's fall around the corner. I think it will make for, <laughs> for some nice photos. Real nice. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Also a good idea. I mean, Ashley, why don't you like Molly's plan? It's not that I don't like it. It's just that our swimsuit edition always sells the best, and if we have a bigger variety of bikini and beach photos in the show in the promo, we'll get more subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> she literally just fucking said this. I see. And Molly, what's wrong? Why do we need this? I figured it would be nice to have something here in Dallas. <laughs> show some city and state pride, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Excuse me, I need to go take a <laughs> take a break. <sighs> she vapes. <laughs> <laughs> she cut off smoking years ago. We need we need to take up the Padre Island in South Texas. That's still within the state, so it shows state pride, and it's pretty nice beach too. It's not as nice as Key West, but I'm sure we can make it work. Molly, it looks like we have a compromise of sorts. A Missouri compromise. <coughs> oh, God. Well, honestly, the main reason I don't go to Key West. <laughs> Fuck. Keep, keep going. You're good. <laughs> it's because the new season is about to start, and I don't really think it's best for the girls to do something so far away. I want the fresh and rested for the opening ceremony next week. <laughs> I see. John, what do you think? Because I forgot you were here. Ma'am, you're asking me to, to decide? Yeah, why not? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, fuck it. Yeah, you, I don't give a shit. You're not even... <laughs> <laughs> you're a fucking football player who just joined this team. Both Ashley and Molly have made solid points, and we can waste the whole afternoon arguing about it. Or we can make a decision right now and go about our business. Now you're gonna have to figure out who you side with <laughs> and who likes you more so you can fuck them. Where do you think the cheerleaders should have their next photo shoot? Alright. 
I don't remember who said. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> President should decide. <laughs> Give it back to her. <laughs> oh, we got an achievement. Oh, look. Look at her little pockets. Those are useful. <laughs> um, let's go with this one. I think doing the photo shoot in South Padre Island sounds like a fair compromise. Also, I agree with Ashley. The best edition of any... Oh, I was hoping Molly would be. <clears throat> Anyways. <laughs> The best edition of any football or sports magazine is always a swimsuit edition, so having extra photos will always drive more subscriptions. Yeah, in the age of the internet. <laughs>